Good afternoon, everyone. I'm meteorologist David Jones with a YouTube heads up about an atmospheric river that's forecast to develop later this week on the south coast. An atmospheric river is a persistent plume of extremely moist subtropical air that delivers heavy rainfalls. You've probably heard the descriptor Pineapple Express and perhaps even Tropical Punch. Both these terms refer to atmospheric rivers on the west coast. At this point, it appears the storm forecast to develop late Thursday and persist through Saturday morning will drench the west coast of Vancouver Island with enough rain to make this a minor but significant Pineapple Express. Here's the 24-hour total precipitation forecast from 4 p.m. Thursday to 4 p.m. Friday, March the 1st. The pink contours represent 50 plus millimeters, while the light purple represents a forecast of about 75 millimeters of rain. Clearly, the outer coast of Vancouver Island near Tofino and the lower mainland are in for a good soaking. Also note the potential for a heavy snowfall across the Columbia Kootenai ranges where 10 to 20 centimeters of snow is possible. The following 24-hour period ending at 4 p.m. Saturday looks almost as wet with another 50 millimeters forecast for the Tofino area, the Sunshine Coast, and Howe Sound. And if this forecast holds true, the heaviest snowfalls may shift to the North Columbia region Saturday while the freezing level rises. Here's the six-day freezing level forecast for Tofino. As usual, the subtropical air will boost the freezing level above 2,000 meters, causing some snow melt in the low elevations. The freezing level will remain high for the duration of the storm through Saturday morning at least. The accompanying precipitation beginning Thursday afternoon will fall at rates of about 5 to 10 millimeters per hour, perhaps higher at times, and a grand total of about 125 millimeters is expected over the two days of the storm. The BC River Forecast Center is following the weather forecast and at present does not expect significant flooding with this storm. However, the intensity, timing, and position of weather systems can change as they approach. We'll stay in touch with the River Forecast Center and keep you informed as the week progresses. That's it for today's Heads Up. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for an update tomorrow or Thursday.